Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah if you are new. I posted on my little community tab thingamajig that I was looking for video requests for 2020 and the top one was to do a vanity tour and I was like what you guys are interested in this and I feel like that would be a little short because literally what you see is what it is um so i'm just gonna throw in my makeup collection as well because a few of you did request that also so yeah i'm just going to walk you through my vanity my kind of diy vanity maybe that's do you guys think this is like a real vanity because it's literally just a desk and then i put a mirror on top but we'll get more into that later anyway let's get into it so this is my vanity setup. This desk is from Pier 1 Imports. As you can see, um, when I was younger, I used to paint my nails on here. And every time I would take my nail polish off with nail polish remover, it like took off some of the paint on the desk. So kind of ugly, kind of need to fix that. But um, let's just start over here. So like, I guess we'll just do this too. This is just like a hat and a scarf that my boyfriend got me. And I just think it looks cute in the background. You know, my favorite pink color. And then we have this cow fridge that my dad got me for Christmas. It makes a really loud noise. So I don't really have it on all the time. I don't know if you can hear that, but um, in order for it to be cool, it just has to make that refrigerator noise that refrigerators make oh my gosh my lighting as you can see very professional setup so in here we have this jade roller which i love my mom got me for christmas and a lot of you guys have been commenting that that my skin has been like glowing recently and i don't know if it's because of this or like something i'm doing different with my skincare or this new light that you guys just saw on my bed it might be that but Thank you guys for that comment, that is so sweet. And I don't know if it's from jade rolling. I don't even know if that, you know, makes a glow on your face or I don't know, man. But thank you guys for that sweet comment. <laughs> and then I just have a little priming moisturizer rich in here, the mini one and a face mask right here from 43 Beauty. And then in this little side door, this came with my jade roller as well. And I think it's something for your face but I haven't figured out how to use this one, so. Yep, that is my fridge. So next is this little tray right here, which is a recent addition, and my brother actually got this for me for Christmas, and it is from Urban Outfitters, and it's really pretty. It has this like rose gold plating underneath, and then I just have, you know, kind of just a random mix of things. I just thought these cherry earrings were cute, so I put them down here. Sometimes I'll throw like hair clips, hair ties, different chapsticks like this one is the one that I always just put on before I film or like before I get ready in the morning so it's just like a tray of cute things and that candle from Urban Outfitters that I also got for Christmas everything new on this vanity you are going to notice has a reoccurring theme of being things that I got for Christmas <laughs> So then up here, we just have some Polaroids. This is me and my brother, Nick. This is me and my boyfriend's dog, Thor, who is like basically my dog. And then this is my old dog, Maya, who passed away last year. Um, that is a Polaroid I took of her when I first got my Polaroid and that is at our old house. So I just love seeing that picture. I really miss her. Now I guess we should chat about this mirror. This is so unprofessional. I'm so sorry about this background. I didn't realize that when you're filming a mirror in like a vanity like this, you'll be able to see everything. This mirror was my grandma's and it is from her house, her old house. My cousins live in her old house and they switched out their mirror. This used to be in the bathroom. They gave it to my mom. My mom was like, I don't know what to do with it. And so she gave it to me and I created this little DIY vanity and I really like it. I love gold mirrors. I love like vintage looking things. So I really like the way that this looks on my desk. And now we just have my brushes. Please focus on the brushes. I used to have a Paris themed bedroom and this, I think I got this at like TJ Maxx or Marshalls back when I had a Paris themed bedroom. I wish I, I'm gonna try to find pictures of it. Um, but it just has some of my brushes in it. Some random makeup items that I use every day as well, like a mascara, eyebrow pencil, stuff like that. So most of these brushes are from middle school, back when everyone used to get these Sigma, I think, brushes. I'm, I don't know why in my head I'm thinking like Coastal Scents, but they're definitely Sigma brushes. But I did get these new ones 
for Christmas and they are from BH Cosmetics. So if you ever see one with a white handle, it's BH Cosmetics. And if you ever see one with a black handle, it is from Sigma from years and years ago. Then I just have this little mirror, which my mom gave my sister as a gift last year and she never used it. So I just use it and it's really nice for looking up close, doing mascara, eyeliner, things like that. Also in my videos when I don't wanna have a big mirror on my bed, cause as you saw my lighting and my whole like YouTube setup is on my bed. So yeah, it just, I like to have something really small. When I do my makeup in the mornings recently, this is a gift that my mom got me for Christmas and it is this mirror. You can see down here where it's from. I'm not really sure like how she went about purchasing this but it is such a thoughtful gift and I use it so much. So it has this little attachment for you to put your phone on and that is where I've been doing like IGTV um, by recent one, little get ready with me. Is there any like phone makeup video? I just magnetic that on there and it's super convenient and really nice. And I know it also has like Bluetooth capabilities and like, I don't know what this camera button means, but you can do really cool stuff with it. Um, but I only use it just for like the lights, you know, you can make it like really bright, you can make it not as bright and it's super helpful because basically in my room after like 11 o'clock in the morning, the lighting in here is very minimal. So this is good to see what my makeup actually looks like. And then one last thing that I forgot to mention is like this little poof thing, which is from Marshalls. You can probably still see the tag down here, which I really struggled to take off, but um, I got this on clearance at Marshalls. It was like 40 bucks and it has storage inside. Honestly, I couldn't tell you what's inside here. A flat iron and some bathing suits. Cool. But yeah, this is my little DIY vanity. This is what you guys see when I film videos and I really like it. It makes me happy. So now moving on to my makeup, I keep it in this little dresser behind me. So my sister made this picture of Zeus. This was like a film picture, film photography. And then these are just some Polaroids from two Christmases this year and last year. A candle, a little hand back there, my prom dried up flowers, just, you know, some little, just some stuff up here. To be honest, it was filled with junk and I cleaned it right before this video. So I keep my makeup in these two drawers. The rest are closed down there and this is like a little junk drawer. So I'm gonna start with like the main one, which is this. This is basically all of my makeup. This might be a lot to you guys. This might be a little bit to you guys, but I'm just gonna go ahead and run through it. So everything that I own makeup wise is here except for my lip products. I accidentally left my lipstick bag at school, so what I have in the middle are just the stuff that I brought. So over here, you can see this is my little Glossier unorganized section. So I really don't know if I organize this the right way. Um, it's kind of by sections of makeup, not necessarily like highlighters, blushes. This is like Glossier and here's like ColourPop. Um, and then here's like miscellaneous. So this is all of my Glossier stuff that I own. As you can see, I got some cloud paint, concealer, all that fun stuff. Back here is just some hair accessories. This is the bag to the makeup brushes I got for Christmas. Here are all of my like foundations and concealers. So got some BB cream, some foundation, two foundations. And that's about it, a concealer in here. These are all of my blushes. So these three and then some highlights. These are the lip products. So as you can see, I just have like the 100% pure ones with me because I happen to have those in my travel bag and I forgot to bring all my lipsticks home. Um, and then here are just some eye products. So mascaras and then eyeliner, eyebrow gel this random eyeshadow that I didn't know what to do with, a NYX Jumbo Eyebrow, <laughs> a NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil, and that is it, basically. That is my makeup. But yeah, that is my makeup, um, the bulk of my makeup. And then in here, I just have ColourPop stuff, so, and the, over there are just all the palettes that I brought home with me. I do have the Modern Renaissance palette and the Anastasia Contour Kit at school still. Forgot to bring those home, but this is just what I have with me right now. 
And then in here is all of my ColourPop stuff, like I said. So just some lipsticks, mascaras, and um, blushes. Just all the stuff you guys usually see me use in videos. Um, but I'm super excited to be finally on the ColourPop PR list now. So hopefully this collection will grow. Um, this is the basket that I brought home all of my makeup in from school. But I, right now I'm just using it as like my new makeup container so every time i get something in the mail or i buy something and i want to use it in a video or like test it out i'll just throw it in here um it's kind of like that bin slash my just color pop bin but yeah that was my makeup collection and vanity tour i hope that was helpful for you guys and it just goes to show you can totally diy your own vanity you don't have to go out and like get one or as twitter i'm sure you guys have seen all over twitter have like your boyfriend build one for you i always see those tweets i don't know why i know it's kind of a chill video but some of you guys seem to like these like more chill videos thank you guys so so much for watching and for subscribing and i will see you in the next one bye guys mm -hmm.